Hey everybody, Don Dabney, owner of Left Coast Classics, and this is just a really cool 1960 Chevy Corvette. And in this video, I'm gonna take you around it, I'm gonna take you under it, we're even gonna take a ride in it. Car just gets up, goes through all the gears beautifully, runs great. It's always been serviced as needed, stored indoors, just treated nicely and used gently. Now everything in here is working except for the clock. We've got working wipers, we've got the uh, radio works, all the lights, the horn, every gauge is working. So it's just nicely functional. Got plenty of power too. It's easy to start when you go in there and it's cold. Couple pumps, turn the key and it starts right up. Braking, suspension. It's nice and tight going down the road too. zip it along we're like at freeway speeds right now I'm doing about ah, well about 50 which is about as fast as I can typically go around here we're going a little fast get it up to 55 60 but it's a very nice car to drive very comfortable a little down shifting transmission feels great Looks like the right blinker is not canceling on the turn. Probably our biggest problem. All right, so there you go. Make sure you stick around because there's so much more uh, coming on this video ahead. We're gonna go under it. We're gonna do all kinds of you know cool things. Listen, to this. sounds so good. Anyway, check all that out. If you're on a third-party website, make sure you get over to my website, leftcoastclassics.com. And uh, it's good over there because there's a lot more information, a lot more content. If you have any questions, you can always call or text me. All the photos I have of the car, I have them in high res, and I'm happy to text you a link to that in my Dropbox. Check that all out. Check us out on three episodes of my favorite car show, Wheeler Dealers. Got the old uh, Ed China Day car. This was, God, this was a long time ago, probably a dozen years ago, this 57 Ford Thunderbird uh, right here, this black one. We did another episode in, I think, 2018. Uh, Really great little red Lancia Fulvia. And then uh, the third episode we did was this one owner Triumph TR4. So if you love Wheeler Dealers, go check all that out. You got any questions, get in touch. Uh, if you want to participate, like and subscribe. We're at somewhere around nine and a half million uh, views over here on my YouTube channel, which is kind of hard to believe. Anyway, get in touch anytime. Phone number is right here, and I'll talk to you soon.
right, let's head underneath the Corvette. And, uh, well, let's start up here. Looks just super original. It's never been like a frame off. Looks like it's got a newer brake line running over there. And let's see what else. And I'm, you know, I'll go through the records and figure things out too. New, newer fuel pump up there, clearly. And uh, some newer shocks. Newer shocks make sense. That actually handles nicely. So let's come back. We're just uh, very original under here. And at some point, there must have been some leak getting all over those uh, <laughs> those mufflers. That we do have a little bit of a leak right there. We're going to torque that down and see if that takes care of that. Pretty minor. And look at that. It even has the original straps to hold it in place, which, of course, with these new gas shocks, you don't need those. But those look like the originals. So kind of just speaks to the car just being an original car. And it is a numbers matching car, and the owner tells us he believes the mileage is original. It's turned over once. Uh, you know, normally I'll come over here with like a light magnet, but <laughs> fiberglass car, that's not going to do us much good. But it's nice to look at the lower portions of the car. You can see how those look. And we haven't even gotten the car over to the detail shop. It'll be over there tomorrow, but it looks good down here. It'll look better after it's detailed. Right, overall looks good.